come see the snow. Oh my god. So good. Eat the back of my Hey guys, I am at Sydney Airport right now. I'm about to fly out. We're going on another trip. <laughs> also, don't mind my voice. I'm just recovering from a completely lost voice like three, four days ago, but it's slowly coming back and hopefully I can talk better by tomorrow. But it should be okay because Michael got me a new mic. So hopefully the quality of my videos and the audio will be through the roof and I'll have a lot better quality content for you guys. I also wanted to say thank you so much for all the support on my Singapore solo trip vlogs. I really didn't expect it but I received so many positive comments from you guys and so much support so it made me want to continue filming and yeah that is what I'm gonna do for this trip. So good. Mm -hmm. Smells like Christmas. Smell it. One thing my sister told me to do is when you go on a trip, buy a new perfume at the start of the trip and use it throughout the whole trip so that when you look back or smell that scent, it'll remind you of the holiday that you were on. So that's what I'm going to do. And I'm trying to find one to get for this trip. I'm thinking to get the limited edition Jo Malone, but I'm not sure which one. First gift for myself. Taiwan at the moment, very, very quick layover. We're here for about three hours and we have a connecting flight that's taking us straight to Sapporo at 8.30. I fell asleep on the flight, so I completely missed breakfast. So I'm feeling a little bit peckish. I kind of want something warm and not too heavy. I'm thinking maybe congee. We're gonna walk around. It's only 5 a.m. right now, not even, it's like 4.50. So I don't know if anything's going to be open, but hopefully at least a few restaurants are. We're just going to walk around and have a look and then make our way to the next gate for our next flight. So it looks like we found some food. We just need to make our way upstairs. And this is me in my lazy girl outfit. <laughs> Most things are closed at this time. I'm thinking things are gonna open around 6 a.m. but I have faith. Wow, this stall here called Moon Moon Food, it's been Michelin rated for six years. Oh, it's a shame that it's closed. Look how cute the Christmas cups are. I'm definitely feeling the Christmas vibes right now. Mmm, this is really good.
right, we've boarded the flight. We are heading to our next destination, which is Sapporo, Kaido, Japan. It'll be about a four hour flight and I am so excited. I chose the seats that are right at the front. We have so much leg room compared to the last flight. Look how much leg space we have. So good. Hopefully they give us food because I'm so hungry. Not many restaurants were open earlier. Anyway, I will see you guys there. Japan. Looking for the train station right now. I'm going to catch the train straight to the hotel, freshen up and start exploring the area. I'm so excited. It's only like 3.30 but it seems like the sun's setting already. This is my favorite time of the day. Oh, I'm so excited. So this is the hotel that we booked. It was actually brand new and at the time when I booked it, it hadn't even been built yet. So there were no reviews, there were only CGI's instead of actual photos. So it was a bit sketched and I was very skeptical when booking it. But then luckily, about a month or two ago, they started posting reviews and photos and then I locked it all in. So let's go see what this brand new hotel looks like. Necessities. All right, the room reveal. Oh, okay. It's pretty good. <laughs> nice and modern. Let's see if we have a view or not. I mean, no, not really, but yeah, this is good enough. So we have our mini fridge here. And looks like there's a kettle. I'll be able to do my makeup here. And we have PJs. Happy with that. What's this? Humidifier and a TV. Ta-da. As for the bathroom, it is just a standard Japanese bathroom electric toilet and shower slash bar. Going to shower and freshen up now, so I will see you guys very shortly when we head back out. I'm feeling the Christmas vibe. It's snowing outside. It's still a little bit early for dinner, so I really want to go to the convenience store and get an egg sander, my favorite, and a few snacks before dinner. We'll eat a little bit later and then we'll have dessert. Anyways, come see the snow. Oh my god. I'm going straight to my fave. Oh, it's still so eggy. Some people aren't a fan, but I love it because the egg is so fluffy and the bread is pillowy soft. Mmm, reunited. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. 
so good. Mm. Mm. Another must if you're going to Family Mart is the Family Chicky. It's fried chicken. Mmm. So fresh and juicy. Mmm. We're gonna go look for gloves because my hands are freezing. Gotta keep these precious fingers warm. So there's nothing I want more than ramen and we are here at the Sapporo New Ramen Street. So we're gonna go get a nice bowl of ramen. Oh. So this one's Michelin rated. Number one recommended. I guess that's the one. This place is called Noodle Fujia Noodle Sapporo. What are they? We got a side of gyoza. Look at it freshly cooked, nice and steamy. It's a that I got the white soy sauce based ramen and it looks so good. It looks amazing. Mm. So good. We'll try this one now. I actually don't really know what it is. Oh wow, the noodles are like thicker and curlier. Oh, that's so good. So creamy. We can add pepper. Is that vinegar? This must be chili flakes. Let's see if that makes it any better. Give it a mix. Mm, that made it better. Mm. It's a bit of mm. Mm. a delicious bowl of ramen I'm so satisfied and I'm getting a little bit hot from the alcohol but on our way to get some parfaits because Sapporo is known for their night parfaits so you go at night so here is the night parfait shop we have to go to level six huh? so it says they have six different types of parfait I just need to like 
rest and have a hot shower but I'll do a very 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 quick haul of what I bought today so starting off with Jo Malone I mentioned that I was going to buy a new perfume for my trip I ended up getting two things so the first one is the limited edition Christmas ginger biscuit cologne and it literally smells like Christmas it smells like gingerbread cookies I am obsessed I'm gonna use it tomorrow because we're gonna go to the German Christmas markets the second thing I got was this set and I'm just gonna use all of them until I decide which full size one I want to get. I already know that I'm going to get a full size English pear. English pear and freesia is what they already had. And there's a new one, English pear and something. But that's the one I'm going to get. We also picked up a bunch of stuff from Uniqlo and GU. This massive puffer jacket. I got a bunch of socks and stockings for the trip. They're heat tech, so they're going to keep us extra warm more. Then from GU, I'm really excited. I got this jacket which was like $70. And I'm gonna wear it tomorrow. The quality is actually really good and it's very warm. And then I also got this coat which came down to like $70 as well. It's just a long coat and I got it in a size up so that it can be a bit more oversized looking. Also grabbed gloves because I needed it for the cold, it's freezing outside. Then we went to Donkey and picked up a few things that we might need for the hotel. And that's the end of my very very quick haul. I am going to shower and rest now but I will see you guys tomorrow. We're gonna have a whole full day of exciting stuff. So thanks for watching today's vlog. See you tomorrow.